So William Borlase's his grammar school on the far side of the course in the Fawley Challenge Cup for junior boys quads and the might of Windsor Boys School A crew on the right of your picture, closest to the island. This is a recording of them off the start and Windsor Boys School look fantastic off the start, don't they? Yeah, Windsor have got such great pedigree in this event for the last two decades, basically. They've been competitive. Um, and Mark Wilkerson, their coach there, does an incredible job of the turner of athletes. But Windsor are the dominant force in junior boys' quads this year. They've pretty much won everything on the domestic circuit, so they are the ones to watch. So we're still looking at the recording of this race. And uh, Windsor, of course, coached by Mark Wilkinson, who's got a fantastic squad, you know, not just in the J18s, but down to J16s, J15s and J14s. I think they've been winning everything nationally. It's incredible what that school has managed to do. And if you're watching this at Windsor Boys School, congratulations for what you've done for the sport of Brian, because it is incredible to see, I guess, a state school like Windsor do so well. And here we go live almost to the end of the race. Uh, we should mention about this incredible athlete um, in the three seed, Marcus Schutz, the Windsor boys, Mark. He seems to be winning everything. He's just got that ability that whatever event he's in, they won that scores in the quad, the single and the double. Yeah, but he so. was yeah he was in the single, Marcus Schutz, yeah. and he's he's the junior, he's young junior under 19 champion. I, I, I gather he's raced the GB Scholars that have gone down to Cavisham to race the GB Scholars and not been disgraced in that contest. So it's phenomenal. They've got a scholar like him in the three seat. They're coming up to the finishing line now. Windsor boys, A crew, take that contest comfortably against the lads from Sir William Borlase's grammar school, A crew. Let's give them a shout out. Bateson, Furley, Ridley and Green. So it's only going to be one race, one result in this race. And that's Windsor boys have proved the case.